So here we are. You've probably seen other reviews of Rage 2 since I'm super late with this one. But there's a good reason. Maybe. Well, I didn't really like the game that much. So, and I really thought about skipping it. Completely. So after you get past the extremely skippable and boring starting scene, you'll find this is as exciting as it gets for the story-wise. Teen Award skippable. So I played it for a few hours and so far nothing really makes me want to invest any kind of time into the story or even paying attention. You'll find many, many scenes that come up, you just want to skip them straight away without even paying attention. And really it's unfortunate because so many things about Rage still make you wonder what the hell the developers were thinking when they're making the game. Now don't get me wrong, this is not completely bad game but there's so many things wrong with it that they should have really you know taken the time together especially how rage one came out so many years ago so first of all the lack of compelling story the uninspired characters that you are or others are take the starting for example you get to choose either male or female and if you choose male for example the female is apparently a buddy of yours that gets killed instantly another friend of yours pops up makes a cheesy joke and, and saves you and this kind of makes you wonder what the fuck is wrong with the people there the lack of empathy you know being your best buddy or whatever and instantly getting killed and the guy just makes a joke about it. Now the story has plenty of immersion breaking stuff in it and even visually this stuff that are immersion breaking. If you look straight down most of your most of the games nowadays you see your whole body or piece of your chest or your legs moving. This is not the case with Rage 2 as you're a floating cloud like freaking lumpy space princess. Now the funny part is in the animation somehow your legs appear when you kick down doors or they disappear again. Then you get stupid things like forcing you to teach you how to shoot a gun or learn how to jump with it stupid shit like come on like it's not like people haven't been playing games before as you can tell by this point yes i really don't like many many things about rage 2 and uh, that's why i didn't even bother putting any time into it and uh, i think that's why it's mostly forgotten about already uh, don't get me wrong, there is uh, quite a few things good with it. The combat is fantastic and it's probably the only thing that kept me going to continue finish this review. Uh, the graphics are also quite beautiful, even how the environment is destructible when you're driving around with your car, like the rocks break apart, which is really nice, I haven't seen that in many games. Even the feel of the cars is quite nice, but when you got all these nice things and then it's led out by so many bad things you got like weird animation of other characters the lip syncing is is off somehow i don't know it just looks weird for the grand goddamn cataclysm don't know if you know but project dagger involves you driving a jury rigged tank into authority headquarters. you got the you know the stupid storyline that's so dull and boring that from the start you don't want to pay attention to the rest I mean come on like, poor, poor writers there what were they thinking and this is kind of the whole wrap up with Rage you know you get two or three things that are really good and the rest that are absolutely crap and I think that's why this game has been forgotten so easily after a few months of being released so as you can guess this is definitely a skippable game because as much as the combat is enjoyable the rest isn't and unless you find it for a cheap sale for like five bucks or something then yeah maybe it's worth considering getting but otherwise definitely a skippable game anyway guys thank you for joining me i know i haven't made a, a video in a while but i'll come around still thank you for all watching with gaming with outcast i'll catch you guys on the next one take care this is outcast and i'm out <laughs>